staying with the US. Uh, last week, the CIA cancelled its contract with the private security firm Blackwater for its operatives to load missiles onto drone aircraft. Well, now pressure is mounting on both parties over the company's alleged role in aiding with snatch-and-grab operations on suspected terrorists in Iraq. Well, for more on this, uh, we can now go live to RT Cedric Moon. He's in our Washington studio. Good to see you there, Cedric. Do you think, then, that uh, this perhaps could spell the beginning of the end of uh, Blackwater's special relationship with the U.S. military? Well, Bill, that's a very, very good question. And uh, to help me answer that question is uh, Wayne Manson, who is a frequent RT contributor. So uh, the CIA director, Leon Panetta, came out and said, at this time, Blackwater is not involved in any CIA oper operations other than security. What does that tell you about the relationship between the CIA and Blackwater? Is it over now? Well, the first thing I think we have to look at is what is uh, Mr. Panetta's definition of security? I mean, we know now that uh, Blackwater now called Z Security Services. They changed their, their name because Blackwater's trademark got such a black eye, no pun intended, uh, they had to do that. But they're still active. They're providing, for example, uh, so-called security services, according to Mr. Panetta, uh, in Baluchistan, uh, province of Pakistan, uh, for an air base, the Shamsi Air Base, from where U.S. Uh, CIA and military operations are launching unmanned aerial vehicles uh, in Pakistan and against Afghanistan and maybe against Iran. Uh, it should be pointed out that Baluchistan is also uh, where the Jandola uh, terrorist group is. It's a Baluchi terrorist group that's active in Iran. And the Iranians know that they were behind a uh, assassination, a terrorist bombing that killed a number of Iranian Revolutionary Guards. So if that's security for Mr. Panetta, that sounds like full-blown uh, CIA Blackwater operations are continuing. We also know that Blackwater is, um, uh, a Z, is also providing security services outside of Peshawar in the Northwest Frontier Province for the Pakistani Frontier Police. Again, uh, th these uh, individuals, th this group, uh, military group, is active against so-called Al-Qaeda and Taliban in Afghanistan. Is that security or is that full-blown paramilitary operations? What is Mr. Panetta's definition of security? Okay. The New York Times last week came out with a very interesting article about uh, the, uh, the Blackwater, uh, I guess, security guards taking part in the most sensitive activities. What does that mean? What do we talk about when, when it comes to most sensitive activities? Well, I think, well, I think when we're talking CIA, in CIA speak, sensitive activities could be anything from assassinating uh, foreign uh, individuals. Uh, we hear that, that we've, it's been reported that um, uh, Blackwater Z has been active against uh, Taliban and uh, quote-unquote al-Qaeda leaders in, in Pakistan and uh, other regions. Uh, but uh, we also have heard from former ISI uh, officials in Pakistan that Blackwater is involved in some of the terrorist uh, attacks and bombings in Pakistan that have been attributed to uh, so-called Taliban in Pakistan and al-Qaeda in Pakistan. So is, is, are these sensitive operations, in fact, false flag attacks? When you just take it a step further, my next question to you is going to be, uh, this really blurs the line between what's military and what's not military, what's more civilian, doesn't it? Can you explain that for us a little bit? Well, I think, uh, you know, when we look at the um, past of the CIA involved in some of these activities, uh, they, they have a very sordid past. And, and uh, it's, you know, it's been suggested by some quarters that perhaps uh, the CIA had some role to play in the assassination of Benazir Bhutto. Uh, now, granted, her husband is now the president of Pakistan, but he's very unpopular. They call him Mr. 10 percent because apparently he gets 10 percent of every contract awarded in Pakistan, maybe including some of these security contracts. Okay. Wayne, thank you so much. We're going to have to leave it at that for now. But, uh, Bill, um, some very interesting stuff when it comes to what kind of uh, hand the CIA plays in other uh, countries' affairs. But for now, we'll send it back to you there in Moscow. Thanks very much indeed. Cedric Moon there, live in our Washington studio.